In this video, I want to show you three types of TikTok that you can create. I will walk you through this as a step-by-step -step tutorial. So idea number one, create a lip sync TikTok. These types of TikToks are based on a trending sound. And many people create TikToks over that same trending sound. And you can create variations of these by adapting to your industry or your related niche. So let's look for a few examples. Here I am on my TikTok search. I'm going to look for social media. And you can see here, you have a list of results. Let's look at social media marketing. And to get more related results, I'm going to click on the top right here. And I'm going to filter for this week and apply. Me? Obsessed with you? So the first yes. one, yes, I this am. is a good example. Me? With you can see that this is based yes. on a trending sound here. Let me look at the sound. Me? Obsessed this is you? the original sound yes. and yes. many Me? people have lip sync Obsessed over you? this. Yes. You can see in this example, this, is, this person is using this lip sync yes. audio to talk about this straw. Me? This creator is using the audio to talk about lip filters. And for social media marketers yes. or yes. your related niche, think about how you can adapt it and use it, write captions and text to use it for something that fits your niche as suggested by this creator here. This one is not a lip sync but this is a trending audio I'm quite sure. And it seems like this audio is used just simply putting text and talking about something embarrassing so you can see how you can relate it back to your niche. So this looks like another Lip sync audio. Let's take a look at this. This is like what? This, this is a dream. A dream. This is a dream. This is a dream. Probably talk about something that's like a dream, a vision that you have, or something this embarrassing. When I decide I want to start posting like an influencer, but I but only have two hundred followers, so that's quite funny. And this is not even this that related, but dream. it's interesting. You can just use the audio for whatever you're talking about, your product, your service. Just because it's trending, it's more likely to push it out. After you see the first snow fit, fall and stop planning, just hope for a snow day. When you're pregnant, it's time to pitch your weird baby names to him. Okay, so now I hope you have a good idea of what types of content you can use for lip syncing and how to look for these content. What you can do is to start saving this content as you scroll on your FYP and when you want to create content, you can come back to it later and create them at one time. So I'm going to look at this creator and she does a lot of these types of lip syncing and trending content. I'm going to use this as the TikTok that I'm going to create. I'm going to click on the sound button here at the bottom right. And then here you have the sound. If you like it, you can save the sound. Or if you like, you can save the post. And I'm going to click use this sound. And I can record up to 6 seconds here. And that depends on the length of your audio. Most of these trending lip sync videos are very short. On the right side here, you click on timer. And you can listen to the audio. You can set a timer, you can set a recording limit. So you can see that it only starts at 0 0.6 seconds and that's something to take note of when you start recording. And for demonstration purpose, I'm going to put a limit here at 3 seconds to show you what it's like to set a recording limit. What this does is that TikTok is going to stop recording at 3 seconds and then you can do something else like change your camera framing, change a location, shoot again at a different place, things like that. And I'm going to start my countdown. 3, 2, 1. Pass, pass, pass. Okay, I'm going to listen to it. And then I'm going to go back. So it doesn't have to be perfect. If you don't like it, you can uh, go back and reshoot again. But what I'm going to do, I'm going to shoot again with a 3 second timer. So this time round, it's going to start from where I left off. And just for demonstration, I'm going to bring it closer to my face for a different angle. 3, 2, 1.
I'm quite happy with this. I'm gonna add text to adapt it to my niche. So let's say you're a social media manager. I uh, talk about social media content. I'm choosing a social media platform for 2023. We'll put Instagram, TikTok, Facebook, Twitter. I'm gonna change the colors here. And then I'm gonna set my duration here. Okay, Instagram will come in earlier again. Okay. I'm fairly happy with this. Let me go to, into the edit here. I'm gonna put this here right in the center. Of Facebook, Instagram. Maybe change it to this. Okay, I'm quite happy with this. So I'll save it. And there you go. Idea number two, create a skit style TikTok. Basically, you have a conversation between two characters and it's a fun and engaging way to explain something. First, you need to plan out your idea. Write a simple script between the two characters. I've drafted out a simple script about saving money. So here it is. Why is it I'm earning more but I'm not saving more money? Well, one reason could be of lifestyle inflation. What is lifestyle inflation? Lifestyle inflation refers to the tendency to increase your spending as your income increase. So how can I avoid lifestyle inflation? You can start by being mindful of your spending habits and resist the urge to upgrade your lifestyle every time you get a raise or a new job. Try to live below your means and save a portion of your income. Okay, so let's get started with shooting. I'm just going to share a few examples that I saved previously. So this creator is not even speaking, they're just using text over and it still gets the point across with a lot of comments, a lot of likes and shares. So this person uses a green screen effect here and it's one of the ways that you can show where the surroundings or setting is. So here you can see this is another example. The conversation starts off with this person speaking to the next person here. This is by Morning Brew and there's a lot of uh, interesting content that they create here. There's a uh, back and forth here and there's not even, and there's not just two uh, characters here, there's like more than that, three. This one's also by Morning Brew, uh, about FTX. And as, again, there's more than two characters here. There's a crypto bro. There's the SBF, and then oh, there's even a VC firm, and then there's the retail investors. What exactly is an API, and why should I care? What is an API? And then the other person explaining what is an API. So I hope we get an idea. Let's get started with shooting. So first of all, because of TikTok's new editor, you can shoot everything for the first character and then the second character and then edit everything later. You can try wearing something different and even try the green screen feature to show something related to what you're talking about. I'm going to go to my effects, select the green screen effect and then choose this photo that I found on Pexels. After I downloaded it, I cropped it to a 9 by 16 uh, aspect ratio. I'm going to choose three minutes for my time, my time limit here. And I'm going to start shooting. Only what the first person is saying. I'm going to tilt myself a bit to the left. And then later for the next character, I'm going to tilt to the right. So I'm going to start shooting. Why is it I'm earning more but I'm not saving more money? I'm going to pause it and start the next one. What is lifestyle inflation? So how can I avoid lifestyle inflation? Okay, right now I'm going to change my top and then we're going to shoot the next character. Here I am with my new top and a wig, a TikTok wig. I'm going to tilt myself a bit to the side here, find a good angle. One reason could be because of lifestyle inflation. Lifestyle inflation refers to the tendency to increase your spending as your income increase. You can start by being mindful of your spending habits and resist the urge to upgrade your lifestyle. Every time you get a raise or a new job, try to live below, try to live below your means and save a portion of your income. So if you're not confident, you can take a few ticks and then edit it later. But we can do that later in the editor. 
Let me go to the editor now and click the tick here. Go to the edit on the top right here. And then the first thing I'm going to do is to move my clips. So I'm going to hold and then drag it over, hold and drag it over, move this uh, here. Okay, now I'm going to cut all the dead spaces here, all the silences in the video. And let's remove this here. Then I'm going to cut this off. I've trimmed down most of my clip, but let's say I don't like this particular clip here. I can click onto the clip and click start over to reshoot this. And you can see that the time, the, the amount of time is the same. And that's going to be my limit. You can start by being mindful of your spending habits and resist the urge to upgrade your lifestyle every time you get a raise or a new job. And then click OK. Gonna trim it again. So obviously it's not perfect, but you get the idea. The green screen effect is not the best here and it's probably not a good idea in these lighting conditions. Another thing you can add is captions. So let's go here and click captions and then TikTok will automatically generate captions for you and you can edit it down move the placement of the captions save it more you can add a trending sound to this click here add maybe this trending sound click on volume and then bring the money. added sound be just a little bit lower what is it may or may not help in getting you more views because of the association to this trending sound so far i don't think it makes a huge difference idea number three create a video on touch TikTok. These types of TikToks can be used in different ways. For example, you can use it to show a place that you have been to. You can shoot a how-to video and add a voiceover later. You can show a product or service. In this example, I want to talk about this fun high element activity that I went to. I've shot videos of it when I was there and I'm going to bring it into TikTok and edit it with the editor, add a voiceover after that. I'm not going to show you any specific examples because these types of TikToks are very common. So here I am on TikTok. First, I'm going to select my sound. I have it favorited here and I'm going to choose this popular sound and click the tick. On the bottom right, I'm going to click on the upload button and look for the clips that I want to add into my video. I By default, I have select multiple selected. I'm just going to choose a few of these clips here and keep in mind that the order that you select it will be how it will first appear and once you're happy you can click next tiktok will auto cut your videos according to the selected audio let's come to the edit on the top right here and you can see the yellow dots represent the cuts based on your selected audio so keep in mind the limit here is 20 seconds no matter what the length of your audio is so you should select an audio that is longer than 20 seconds if you want to reach that limit. If you want to change your audio, you can always do it here. Come down here, click on the audio, click on replace sound. And the first thing that we'll do, let's reorder the clips in the order that we want to. So you can reference the yellow dots below to edit your clips. I'm going to delete some that I changed my mind about. I don't want them anymore. I'm going to move them around to an order that is suitable for my uh, voiceover. So let's say I'm happy with this cut. I'm going to come back here and click on sound sync again for it to re-sync the sound. I don't like where the first part is. I'm going to click on replace sound. Click on the scissors here and move the start of the audio to five seconds so you'll start after five seconds of the audio and then let it re-sync again i will continue to move my clips around again I, let me continue to edit it a little bit more and then i'm going to re-sync it again so let's say you're happy with this the next step you can do is come in here to each video click into it click adjust and by default tiktok 
starts the video off at the zero second of your video you can adjust this let's say you like the last part of your video instead you can move it and save it you can do the same for different videos so this is why i like the tiktok editor you can't do this as easily on instagram keep in mind once you adjusted your clips you don't want to sync your sound again if not it will reset and start all the clips from zero again let's say you want your video to go longer than 20 seconds you can do this by adjusting your clip length here maybe adjust the clip length of this one here and then come in here to your audio and drag the audio out to be as long as your video so now my video is 22 seconds but you don't want to click on sound sync again if not you'll reset back to 20 seconds so once you're happy you can click save and the next step i'm going to add my voiceover come on to the right side here then i'm going to look for audio editing so it's good to have a script that you outline and you can just read off the script i've already done so so i'm going to click record and start speaking this is escape we went for infinity beyond which is a high element adventure thingy paid 35 dollars each for 45 minutes you can go as much as you want then with it it was free to go to the warrior challenge a smaller version we went on a weekday afternoon so there was almost no one so you don't have to wait so you can save it and you can see how it sounds like i'm going to come in here to the audio click on volume reduce the other sound volume to about maybe 10 percent so that the voiceover can be heard a little better you can also add captions to make it easier to read and also give tiktok a sense of what your video is about you'll probably need to edit your captions and the exact transcript of what the captions is and you're done so that's it if you're a beginner and you want a full introduction to creating on tiktok check out my tutorial in this video